fellow left-handed drivers. Well, uh, my accident uh, has been resolved, and I am innocent. I am uh, not. Unfortunately, though, I'm not taking the car in until uh, December 27th for them to take a look at all the damages, and then as soon as they can start working on it is January 10th. Uh, so my car is drivable, even though it doesn't look that good. I'm going to go out and uh, I'm going to take a chance anyway. Um, I've, I've checked the doors and uh, they're they're good. They're holding the lock and everything, and that was my biggest concern um, in case anybody leans on the door. But uh, it's good. I was throwing my big body on there and I couldn't get it to budge, so that's good. It's locking. No signals are coming on, so we're good. We're good there. And um, that's it. So we're going to head out uh, December 23rd and uh, try to get a couple of fares. And then I'll just explain or ask kindly to people if they leave any comments, not to mention the, the dent on this side of the car. So that's it. Stay tuned. Let's see how we did. And uh, I've already got uh, tips from my airport run yesterday. So uh, that's good. That's good. Tip Jar Tuesday will not be an empty container. It's going to have some money in it. <laughs> that's all for now. So my uh, first passenger that I pick up getting back on the road, <laughs> turns out it's LaRabi, the last guy I picked up that I got in the accident with. Um, so that's that's pretty interesting uh what a coincidence that was but uh um, he was telling me that they had call, called him and i told him all about uh, the issues i was going through and everything got fixed so uh, pretty cool uh, no tip and i wasn't expecting one but i gave him a uh a gift card to uh starbucks because he uh he was he, he could have probably done a lot worse we both could have been in a lot worse shape, but uh, it worked out for the best for both of us. And uh, that's it. So let's go get uh, another passenger. Hey, while I'm thinking about it, you know something else that Uber should do, um, at least in the Washington, D.C. area, and actually probably everywhere because there will probably be all kinds of parties, but um, get rid of Uber Pool on uh, New Year's Eve. Uh, hopefully that thing's not running. And then on, we're going to have the inauguration out here, as everybody knows. Um, we are uh, putting in a new president and it's going to be crazy downtown I got to tell any driver out there if you take an Uber pool you are insane because as we all know the way Uber pool works is uh, they have a fixed fare from A to B traffic's going to be so bad you could easily just trying to go a few blocks in DC could take you an hour you're going to get paid 5 or 6 bucks for that I wouldn't accept a single Uber pool down in Washington, D.C. during the inauguration. And then the day after that, there's the uh, the Million Woman March thing or whatever they're doing. Uh, same thing there. Traffic's going to be bad. I would not accept Uber pool rides. If you do, you're just going to be killing yourself because those rides are going to be 4 and $5, and you're going to be sitting there for an hour in traffic. You might get lucky and uh, not catch any of that traffic, but... If you're anywhere near uh, Constitution or Pennsylvania, uh, around around the monuments at all, it's going to be trouble. So that's all I got to say about that. Well, second ride, and I got another tip. Tip jar is looking good. That was a gentleman named Chance and his buddy. They were going to uh, the mall to uh, do a little uh, racing. They got a Grand Prix racetrack inside the mall there, which is pretty cool. So they were going to do that. And uh, that's it. Two rides. Today, one tip. Stay tuned. Well, today is looking to be a good day. That was Michelle. I just picked her up. We had a great conversation. Uh, she definitely enjoys my trivia game. Um, she did not play it today. But uh, she definitely likes the idea. I told her that you know, season one is over and I haven't started season two yet. And uh, with that, she also gave me a nice little tip. A nice little tip. So, Michelle, if you're watching, 
and I did give her the information to watch the show. Thank you very much, and I hope you had a very Merry Christmas, and that I uh, will see you again someday. That's all. Let's go and pick up uh, Rick, see what Rick's doing today. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned. We got more passengers coming at you shortly. Woohoo! Hey guys, this, this has been a crazy great day. Um, I just dropped off uh, Rick and his wife to, um, they're going to Florida at the airport. $10 tip. Um, I've, uh, was it three, four out of five trips today have been, uh, have been tips. We're doing good. Let's go see what the next ride's gonna be. Right now the airport is packed. Just packed. And I got the inside lane, so I'm gonna be a while getting out of here. All right, stay tuned, we'll see who's next. Thanks again, Rick. Hope you guys had a great trip. I don't know about you guys, but if you were me, and I know you're not, I would be setting my uh, YouTube channel to make sure I'm watching Tip Jar Tuesday because it's going to be pretty good. <laughs> and it's only Friday! Stay tuned. Right now we are going to do, that's right, a Starbucks break. You guessed it, you win a Starbucks! And 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 I win a Starbucks! We're going to Starbucks. We'll be right back. All right. Did a couple of things here. Besides buying uh, Starbucks. I had to replenish my gift cards uh, stash. So, uh, bought a bunch of gift cards to give out to my uh, customers and uh, that's it it's uh, three o'clock and what have we made so far wow seventy dollars for how many trips one two three four trips four trips seventy dollars <laughs> that's pretty good <laughs> Uh, all right, that's all we got for now. All right, that was Simon and his family. I just took them to the airport. They're on to sunny San Diego. No tip that time. He said he didn't have any cash on him, which I realized that. A lot of people don't have cash on them, and we're okay with that. It was a very short trip anyway, probably about uh, 10 bucks. Plus, he's going to have to pay the airport fee, so his cost will be about 14 And uh, that's about it. So, all right, let's go. Uh, ooh, there's 198 cars at the waiting lot here at the airport. I'm not going to jump on that. Or am I? Do I want to? No, it's not. Let's keep driving. Suburbs are doing well. We'll be back. Stay tuned for more from Uber DC. I mentioned Starbucks. Actually, I should get something to eat. I haven't had anything to eat today. All right. Let me put on my uh, Santa hat. All right. That wasn't a trip, but I just called my friend out in Los Angeles, California. The latest state to legalize marijuana. Today is her birthday. So, happy birthday, Ina. Why not everybody down below leave a little comment wishing Ina a happy birthday. I think she'd get a kick out of that. Let's see how many people we can get to wish her a happy birthday. I will not tell you how many birthdays this is for her because I probably won't ever see her again if that happens or get to talk to her again. But um, Long story short, she was actually the first gal I ever talked to on the internet. AOL way back when, which what, 1996 or 97? Something like that. And we still chat today. So pretty cool. Anyhow, happy birthday, sweetheart. Mwah. Right here? Yep. All right, thank you very much. And Merry Christmas. Hopefully you like Starbucks. 
Yeah, we'll get you a cup of coffee or whatever you like. Yeah. You're welcome. Nice. <laughs> yep. Take care. I'm going to watch you go in the door. 1722? Yeah. Okay. Good. I'll make sure you get in okay. Well, that was Mary. We are in Washington, D.C., and it is lit up. And she is good to go. Another passenger dropped off. And a happy customer. We gave her a, a little Christmas gift of a uh, Starbucks gift card. So I'm supposed to sign off with. Thanks for watching another video from Uber DC. This was just uh, another day in the life of an Uber driver. And uh, Uber on, everybody. Lift on, everybody. Thanks for watching, and I am out of here. Good night. Hey, Merry Christmas, everybody, and a Happy New Year. Hope 2016 was very good to you, and 2017 will be even better. I want to thank every one of you for supporting my channel, for making packs a success, and Tip Jar Tuesday Entertaining. Look forward to a lot more videos, a lot more packs, a lot more Tip Jar Tuesdays. Merry Christmas, everyone. Thanks again for your support. Cheers.